In this video, we're going to have a Shaver Gen and unboxing. Stay tuned. Hey there folks and welcome back for another video. I'm your host CDB and thanks so much for joining me today. I really appreciate it. As always, before we get into the content, a word from our sponsor, Leaf. This video is brought to you by our good friends at Leaf and you know I love Leaf products. I love using the Leaf, which you've seen me use many, many times on the channel. I also love using the Twig. You've seen that a lot on the channel as well. If you'd like to save 5%, Use discount code IMCDB right there and save 5% while shopping with the good folks at LEAF. And now, back to the video. And all right, folks, we are back. Welcome in, welcome in. And let's start with the shaverage. And it is Sierra Mist. And this is a nice, refreshing lemon-lime type soda, I think. And I've got it here on the rocks. Here's to you. Hope you're having an excellent day so far. All right, and that is nice and refreshing. The unboxing instrument for today which was recommended to me by viewer Go Hobbs. So thank you, Go Hobbs. It's the Civivi Baby Banter. And it is very flippy, as you can see right there. It is really fun to flip. And our package today comes to us from the Razor Company. I made an order with the Razor Company, and this one's been sitting a while. I haven't had a chance to unbox it. So today, we'll find out together what's in here. Um, I don't even know if I remember it. <laughs> so the, here is our box, and we will cut this tape Always well packaged from the Razor Company. And I think we ordered a couple of soaps, if I remember correctly. And let's see what we have. In top, there's a little uh, thank you note here from the Razor Company, which I've never seen one of those before. That's pretty cool. And uh, first, we have a soap from House of Mammoth. And I don't know how to say this one, but let's go ahead and open this and we'll show it to you. Really like the artwork and the color on this one. I think it really pops. That is really nice. I love the mammoth sort of logo. It's pretty cool. And this one, I think the name of it is yeah, right there. And I don't know how to say it, so hopefully we'll learn to say it before we use it. Uh, I really like these jars. Mammoth comes in very nice, elegant, well done. But the most important thing, how does it smell? And that's what we're really interested in today. Nice pour there, and let's give it a whiff. Oh, wow. I don't know how, what I think of this one. It's got a brightness to it, but there's also a almost smoky vibe I'm getting. Uh, I don't know how I feel about it, to be honest. I don't dislike it, but I don't love it either. It's definitely got some darkness to it in the background. I think the first thing I get is a little bit of sweetness. Then there's some darkness um, or smoky sort of vibe is what I'm getting. Um, it's a very unusual scent. I don't know how... <laughs> I don't know how to describe this one at all. I'm not sure it's gonna be a winner to be honest, but I'm, I'm, I'm curious about it. This scent has really made me curious as to what's gonna happen when I lather it because part of it's a little bright and then there's this sort of smoky, dark sort of scent in the background. It's not funky, uh, cause if it were funky, I'd be giving you the funk face, believe me. But there's a darkness, smoky something in there. It's very, very unusual scent but i do love the packaging and the label it is tremendous the scent i'm not sure on it's you know so so for now but we'll hope that when i lather it it will get better but it's not repulsive like it's not one of those scents where i open it and go oh that's terrible it's just got a weird sort of i don't know how to describe it, it it's <laughs> i can't describe it okay the other one is from katie's bubbles and it's oh de, uh, i don't know you know these french names with the katie's bubbles uh who knows Looks like um, looks like a lemon and ginger. Maybe that's tea there. I'm not sure. Maybe it's a tea scent. I can't recall what the notes are, but uh, let's give it a whiff because we'll see if we like this one. That's nice. Ah, that's bright, nice, sort of a green. I'm getting a green vibe off this. I'm getting ginger, I think. Definitely a tea sort of vibe, which I think is what that is. Ginger, um, lemon, a little bit of tea. That's nice. This one I like a lot. This one I think is going to be right up my alley. It is nice. It is bright. It smells very uh, uplifting, bright. I love it. I love this one. I think this one is going to be a hit for sure. The other one, the mammoth, uh, you know, I'm kind of on the fence about, but it has sort of piqued my curiosity because the scent is so unusual. I don't think I've ever smelled anything like this one. So if you're in the market for something that is completely unique, this might be it. Whether it's unique in a good way or not remains to be determined, but uh, we'll see what happens when we use it. All right, 
Thank you so much for joining me today. I really appreciate it. Let me ask you, did you get anything recently that you're really happy with? Please comment below and let me know what that item or items were or was or something like that. Anyway, thank you so much for joining me. Until next time, I've been your host CDB reminding you, get your shave, do it your way, and as always, God bless.